but no worries. Oh, yeah. All right. There you guys go. Um, and this is kind of like the touristy strip. Uh, past September, late September, it all closes down uh, when the cruise ships stop coming in, so. All right, y'all. I want to walk you through the experience of Alaska float plane fly fishing trip run by Bear Creek Outfitters. They provide all of your equipment including waders and fly rods, but I recommend bringing a net if you have one to help land your fish. So let's get started with the safety brief. Uh, but if you're all set to go, go ahead and take a seat on the bench. We've got a radio from the Bear Creek Outfitters. Risk the knowledge of the form. Let's know what you guys, what you guys get yourself into. I acknowledge that I am undertaking a wilderness catch and release fly fishing excursion to be a float plane and that doing so involves apparent risk hazards. Such risks include, but are not limited to, falls in cold water emergencies, accidental hookings, air related accidents, wildlife and insect encounters, and trip delays. Radio and cellular phone service may not be possible in some locations, making emergency assistance difficult and or impossible to obtain. I guess they use these on people who uh, get out of the line while fly fishing. Big drop. <laughs> that would have been bad to hit right there. <laughs> Just When you land, the guides assemble the rods, get the tackle ready, and then perform a quick but very thorough fly fishing instruction. Slimy, yeah. You get your tail or your hand right around the base of their tail, it's a good way to grip them. Okay. There you go, just like that, exactly. Perfect, man. Beauty. Get that chromer. <laughs> yeah. Nice, bright fish, man. Fresh from the ocean right there. <laughs> Doing the salmon juggle. Salmon juggle. There you go, Willie. Let's line on out there, Willie. Woo! I want to have about two feet of fly line. Man, you know the drill. 
So I only participated in the three hour trip, but they have longer trips. And um, as you see, I, I still had such a great day. Uh, this was in late July, which is apparently one of the best times to go, go fishing for salmon up there. And, you know, I can't say enough about Bear Creek Outfitters and how awesome this trip was. The float plane ride was just was so cool. Uh, I mean, they land very, very softly. Like, you can barely even tell it lands. All right, y'all, so go check out Bear Creek Outfitters. Please subscribe and have a good one.